My name is Courtney Ross. I'm the fiance of George Floyd. On earth and in heaven, he will always be mine. He will always be the love of my life. I'm not calling for an evening of peace, but I am calling for an evening of non-violence. If you are using Floyd's name in any way to promote that, that is not what he was about. If you knew him, he was about peace, love, inclusiveness, and helping people. If he saw anything going on that, was, that caused violence or was hurting someone, he would take his six feet long arms out and try and stop them and then pray with them to make sure that they could go on with a better day and not act out in the devil's way. So again, I pray, I pray, Minneapolis, that we have a non-violent evening. You can still fight. Come with us. All right. I just thought about it as the same thing with my brother. Uh, people didn't know who my brother was. Uh, they, they labeled him. The trial was all about my brother. Instead, it, it should have been about Mr. Chauvin. So the things that she spoke about, I understand that because that's her son. Same way she spoke up for her son, I spoke up for my brother. So we all, we all love our loved ones, but the fact that I will never see my brother again is, is worse because she still will have the opportunity to see her son in the cell anytime she wants to. When I heard his mother speak, okay, and I respect any mother stand up for their son, mm -hmm. but it reminded me, and I said it in the eulogy right here, mm -hmm. that George called for his mother. Mm -hmm. And the one that seemed not to understand the bond between a mother and son, when a son would call for his mother that was no longer alive, was not the Floyd family. It was her son, Derek, mm -hmm. because that did not make him mm -hmm. stop when he heard a man call for his mother. I respect his mother. He did not respect George calling for his mother. 